Taiwan is not that famous, but actually it's kind of like a hidden gem to me when I moved there. Not so many people will know about the place, but actually I found a lot of benefits. And the biggest one I recommend to my friends is actually the quality of life. To me, it's the most important one. It's not just about the career, it's also about having a fulfilling life beyond a career. I was born and raised in Paris, in France. I spent my first 20 years there because I knew I could always stay in Paris. I could have a usual life and work and home in Paris, but I thought I wanted to discover other places. And that's how I ended up doing my MBA in Hong Kong, which was a good place for me to start as a foreigner, to have a little bit of experience living full time uh, based uh, in Asia. And after my MBA, I wanted to take a lot of risks, but calculated risks. And in Taiwan, I saw my industry is more semiconductor, electronics, telecommunications, uh, green power, renewable energies. So actually, Taiwan is strong in those particular areas. So I felt it would be more successful for me to join this community in Taiwan first. Because in Taiwan, what's special, it's, it's both high quality of life, meaning the healthcare system is good, the air is good, the food is great, the people are very kind and relaxed out there. And the cuisine type, you know, the, the type of food of Taiwan is actually quite special. There's a lot of variety and one specifically kind that I really like is actually for breakfast stuff. So I like the, the kind of crepe and uh, soybean milk. You can find a really high quality food uh, in some, you know, street places with just like a simple uh, plastic chairs, but the food is really good and cheap. But on the other hand, I wanted to find a place where I could feel like I was safe, I would be healthy, and where I could also fulfill my, my hobbies and my activities. And I found all of that in Taiwan. My biggest activity and hobby has been yoga for more than a decade. So when I moved to Taiwan and I started to join this, this yoga studio, it was very helpful for me coming as a foreigner. It was a good uh, ecosystem for me to practice a healthy activity and have fun and also make some new friends. I work for a Taiwanese startup called Ubik. It's a very young company, only been here for four years. As a startup, the management team has brought together not only Taiwanese locals, but also a number of foreigners. We have people coming from Russia, from India, from Australia, from Europe. So it's a little bit uh, of a special case in which we like to bring the best of both local talents and also foreigner talents. I like to recommend to my friends about Taiwan, being able to enjoy a safe place with good quality of life and overall low costs. Well, those things to me are making Taiwan a gem that is not so famous yet. So it's, um, there's not so many foreigners going to Taiwan just yet. I think I can see there's more and more coming here and I can understand that. So I would stress to my friends about the quality of life that foreigners can have in Taiwan.